Here we go again. Conor McGregor has announced his retirement on Twitter. No, not that one. Or even that one. Uh, yep. That's the one. Again. Retirement for McGregor means he can now sit back, relax, pull up a high chair to the bar and unwind. Just on his own and undisturbed. Just like these guys did. Perhaps this is all just fake news. Maybe this is just another Wolf of Wall Street moment where Jordan Belford, played by my personal man crush, Leonardo DiCaprio, such a hunk, at least had the decency not to let us down with his retirement on Twitter. If you are going to retire, you have to make it epic, you have to own the moment. Some like to go out with a bang, some go out while they're still on top, and with some, some will just refuse to retire at all. Maybe I am just upset because McGregor was the greatest, most destructive, iconic fighter we've had in this country since the hard man king, Roy, who, let's not forget, had some shock retirements of his own, but we'll not talk about that Saipan incident. McGregor has had more retirements than fights in the past four years. He's had more retirements than even this guy. You just got Rick ruled. <laughs> we need McGregor back. The next big sporting event is the Olympics, and God only knows how far away that's going to be, and our only hope in that competition is these two. And let's face it, that's in Rome. We need McGregor back. Just as badly as the Republic needed Roy, Americans need guns, and your man needs new episodes of Coronation Street during lockdown. We need him back. The point I'm trying to make here is if you're going to be the biggest mixed martial arts star in the history of the world, you can't quite like this. We need one more red panties night. We need one more who the fuck is that guy moment. We need one more excuse to fill Croker and go down and get in the lash all day. So what do I think? Well, Mystic Shawnee Mac predicts that McGregor will be back. And this time he's only going to be assaulting within cages. He's going to give us an actual valid reason why he needs to sit up to 5am and get in the beer. That's my take anyway. See you later.